Hey everybody, welcome to Dad, Daughters, and Drinks, where you'll always be guaranteed to get at least two of those three things. Today you've got me, the Margarita Kid, and I am drinking actually just coffee at the moment. I'm needing to wake up a little bit, and I think this will help, and I also think uh, the song will probably help, knowing the rest of the baby metal music that I've heard. Uh, so we're going to be reacting to today a song I haven't heard before, Karate. Uh, this is live UK download 2016. I don't know anything about this one, but we're going to go ahead and let her rip. Okay, I don't know if you guys are listening to this with headphones or not, uh, but the guitars going back and forth here are really awesome. Okay, this guy here, man, he's rocking out. Uh, usually, you know, the concerts that I've seen, and I haven't seen a ton of these guys, I bet, uh, but usually the band is a little more unobtrusive, farther back. I guess maybe this is a smaller stage. And I don't remember them being so animated, but they're really rocking on this tune. Uh, I'd really like to see that. You know, and I think, uh, in general, these musicians, and I think people have said that they're kind of like the top uh, musicians. Uh, these guys are good. And just one other thing, and I'm sorry I keep stopping, but he's the bass player, and usually it's the bass players are the least animated people in the band, uh, so it's doubly awesome that he's rocking out like that. Uh, also, I noticed he's playing a five string, and you know, I guess I grew up, you know, most bass players are playing four strings, but I'm starting to realize that seeing four string basses and you know, more modern concerts is a little less common, maybe, I guess. I hadn't really noticed that, but I've been doing a lot of a newer concert footage recently and it seems like everybody's using five strings. I love that it was almost like a I'm gonna go back a little bit like it was almost like a Middle Eastern kind of melodic harmonic minor progression there and her vocals that was really cool over the top of you know the the metal in the background
Wait a minute. If I remember correctly, I forgot that this was in London. Don't they have a different band that they use when they're traveling uh, outside of Japan? Uh, maybe that's why they're seeming to be a little more animated. Maybe it's different people than what I'm used to seeing. You can really see in this shot that the rain's coming down. I wasn't sure at first if it was raining or not. Uh, it's clearly getting a pretty cloudy day, and I started to see people, you know, wearing rain coats in the in the audience. Uh, but I bet this kind of music would really kind of drive the clouds away, you know, metaphorically. So anyway, yeah, that was a fun tune. Uh, you know, as always, you know, I didn't really know what they were saying. You know, maybe one of these days I'll start looking up translations, but I really don't feel the need to necessarily with their music. I really just enjoy it. Um, and, you know, it's called karate, and, and it seemed that the dance moves were, were inspired by that. So um, I don't think there was any sort of a double meaning that I was missing. And maybe if there is, let me know. In any case... Um, it's been a couple weeks since my last video. I took a, a long vacation in between around the holidays, but I'm back and I'm looking forward to uh, taking a look at some more baby metal. So please keep the comments coming and let me know what you want to see next. Thanks and have a great day.